Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 moments from Godzilla vs. Kong. The Apex Titan. <laughs> it's time to show the world what you can do. For this list, we're looking at the most memorable scenes from this MonsterVerse heavyweight title bout, probably because they were downright awesome. At what point did your jaw hit the floor? Pound your chest and let out a giant lizard screech in the comments. Number 10. Godzilla Destroys Apex Base Whenever a new, shady organization pops up in one of these movies, we are instantly suspicious. And Apex Cybernetics is no exception. Keen to their villainy, Titan conspiracy theorist and podcaster Bernie Hayes infiltrates the organization's compound in Pensacola, Florida, and gets to snooping. Something bad is going on. I don't know what it is, but I'm about to walk in and download hard evidence and expose a vast corporate conspiracy. Just as he thinks he's found something, Godzilla makes his presence known in a big way. The titular kaiju lays absolute waste to the facility, making us wonder if he's suddenly broken bad. Still, we get the sense that he's after something. And Bernie gets a taste of that as he spots a suspicious glowing orb in the wreckage. At that point, he could only imagine the devastation that was to come. Number 9. Throne Room Skirmish Upon leading the Apex team through the Hollow Earth, Kong discovers a throne room that his ancestors created and ruled from, complete with an ancient axe made from the bones of another Godzilla-like creature. Kong subsequently unleashes the energy buried within the Earth, much to the delight of Apex and to the displeasure of Godzilla. Upon blasting his way into the hollow earth, Godzilla awakens the throne room's protectors in the form of Hellhawks. As our protagonists attempt to flee, Kong cleans house of his unwanted visitors, and that includes the hasty apex scientist Maya Simmons. That's okay, Kong. We didn't really like her anyway. No, 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 no! Number 8. Mecha Godzilla Lives. That's Robo Godzilla. No, that's. That's Mecha Godzilla. Mecha Godzilla being in this movie wasn't one of the best kept secrets, but we have to admit we were giddy when he finally came online. After our Titan truthers are unwittingly shuttled from the Apex base in Florida to the one in Hong Kong along with some skull crawler eggs, they discover something truly terrifying. They find themselves smack dab in the middle of Mecha Godzilla's launch facility, where Apex uses a grown skull crawler as a warm up test. Mechagodzilla may have saved our heroes from being swallowed up, but he shows his true menace when he completely eviscerates the creature that gave Kong a run for his money two movies ago. Mechagodzilla may be new to the fight, but he is here to slay. I have faith in our creation. My humanity will once again be the apex species. Number 7. Gia Comforts Kong In a scene reminiscent of Kong's interactions with the Anne Darrow character in his original adventures, the young Iwi girl Gia connects to the titular ape in a way not many ever could. Is she supposed to be out there? As a fettered and sedated Kong is being transported to Antarctica aboard a large ship, Gia goes out to comfort him in the rain. In one of the film's most iconic images, she reaches out and touches his giant finger in a moment of sympathy. Not only that, but their bond reveals Kong's ability to communicate with her through sign language, proving there's more humanity to the furry creature than meets the eye. Man, we just want to give Kong a big giant hug. Number 8. 
Number 6. Mecha Godzilla Takes Over. The Apex Titan of my own hand. <laughs> it's time to show the world what you can do. As Apex soon learned, playing with the remains of an evil kaiju head probably wasn't a good idea. In a desperate bid to reclaim humanity's spot as the world's apex predator, oh, that's why they're called that. CEO Walter Simmons utilizes the remaining Ghidorah skull to power the neural link between Mechagodzilla and Ren Serizawa, son of the late Ishiro Serizawa. The trouble is, something goes wrong with the connection, and Mechagodzilla gains autonomy. Making sure the power-hungry villain reaps what he sows, Mechagodzilla wipes out his creator with one fell swoop. Sarazawa is subsequently fried, and suddenly we've got something on the loose much more dangerous than Godzilla. Number 5. Home Sweet Hollow Earth What's up, guys? He's coming around for his morning walk. Following the climax of the film, Kong is finally able to hang it up and reclaim dominion over the Hollow Earth. Reflective of the first scene that saw Kong go about his morning routine on Skull Island, the final sequence shows him now free to do as he pleases while still being lovingly looked after by doctors Nathan Lind and Eileen Andrews. He signs home to Gia before swinging into action, and the final shot shows Kong letting out a roar that symbolizes he's finally free. We don't know if Legendary plans to continue with the franchise, but a Kong Hollow Earth movie would be super cool. Number 4. Battle at Sea What you saying? Godzilla. <laughs> When the trailer for Godzilla vs. Kong dropped, we were so ready for the first confrontation. And their showdown on and around an aircraft carrier did not disappoint. Interrupting Apex's voyage to Antarctica with Kong is the great kaiju himself as he quickly engages with the great ape. holds his own, but proves to be at a severe disadvantage out in the open water. Godzilla tries to capitalize on this, as he's eventually able to drag Kong down to the briny depths. Desperate to save Kong, the human team distracts Godzilla long enough for Kong to resurface. Fearing a Godzilla counterattack, the humans feign defeat by powering down, letting Godzilla leave thinking he's won. He might have taken this round, but Kong will rebound for sure. Number 3. Journey to the Hollow Earth One of the most refreshing aspects of Godzilla vs. Kong were definitely its vibrant visuals, and they are on full display in this scene. Leading the Apex team down the Antarctic Tunnel, Kong swings his way down until a portal of sorts shoots them the rest of the way to the Hollow Earth. There, we're presented with a lush and almost prehistoric landscape, one that Kong's ancestors called home. It isn't long, though, until Kong and the gang are greeted by the region's dominant species in the form of war bats. Though nearly suffocated, Kong gains the upper hand and shows he's here to stay. He celebrates with a refreshing batch of, um, little intense Kong, don't you think? That's Gross. Number 2. Hong Kong Smackdown This is the heavyweight Smackdown we were promised, and it more than delivered. Kong emerges from the hollow earth in Hong Kong, <laughs> King Kong in Hong Kong, anyway, where he and Godzilla have the fight of their giant lives. Kong has to go on the run from Godzilla's atomic breath, but he's ultimately able to use his axe to absorb it and deal Godzilla some serious punishment. Oh. 
Down but never out, Godzilla shakes it off and re-enters the fight, and this time he gets the better of Kong. With one foot pinning the ape to the ground, they each let out a roar in one of the film's best shots. With Kong's heart rate slowing, Godzilla leaves him to his fate. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Godzilla and Kong vs. Mechagodzilla We weren't sure how Mechagodzilla was going to keep pace, seeing as his classic appearances portray him as rather, well, mechanical. But he absolutely owns here, laying the smack down on his organic counterpart. Aware they need Kong to intervene, Lind and company manage to use the energy Apex harvested from the Hollow Earth to give him a kickstart. Kong takes a crack at Mechagodzilla himself, but he too is overwhelmed. It isn't until Godzilla uses his atomic breath to charge Kong's axe that the tables turn, at which point Kong eviscerates the mechanical monstrosity. Having saved the day, the two titular titans acknowledge each other before going their separate ways sure to meet again. And we cannot wait for that day to come. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.